Cecil Hodgins came to join us today from Bristol Auto Performance with his 2017 Corvette Z06. Now these are a supercharged 6.2 liter, and what you can do is a couple of quick hop-ups, and they've chosen to put the Lingen filter kit on this. Basically a bottom pulley that spins the supercharger more quickly. We know that the fueling is going to be off. It's going to require more fuel to go with the more air that comes in. We also know that these pulleys taper off a little bit over on the top end, which means that we're going to spin the supercharger a little quicker. It's going to require a completely different fuel curve. Wally's going to work on this. We know that the kit says it's supposed to make an advertised 720 horsepower at the crank. I think on today, with this car, the way Cecil drives, we're going to be able to get just above that. we become accustomed to we always do every procedure the same way we run a few baseline passes we make a few changes we go through the middle of our tune we make a few more changes and we keep working at it until we get it correct let's see where we started so today when we came in we had 570 foot pounds to the wheels and 523 horsepower Wally had a peek at what was happening we had a lot of black smoke coming out of the tailpipe and he made a whole bunch of changes Already halfway through our tune, we've started to get the fueling pretty dialed in. We start moving the camshaft. We start changing the ignition time, and we start making the boost curve what we want it to be, and we start getting some good results. At this point, we're up to 694 foot-pounds of torque at the wheels, 598 horsepower. At the end, Wally always makes three back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back passes. You want to check your tune, you want to check to make sure you don't have any knock, you want to make sure that even when the engine's warm, it's going to run correctly. Well, this engine does more than run correctly. It makes a boatload of power, and on our second pass of our three-pass run, we actually made the most of any of them, which means even when it's hot, it's still making good power. Here we go. 654 horsepower at the wheels, 727 foot-pounds of torque. That is one healthy car, and Cecil Hodgins is gonna go home with a huge smile on his face, and if he ever thought it was slightly quick before, this is a whole different beast.